kita. Tahu pun mai. Gih. Kaya? Enggak ana Jun. is also where we go washing clothes so good morning guys so right now we are here at coco farm earlier from the main road to here um i guess three minutes only by truck but it's very rocky um the truck is there and this one is my auntie's house um this area is my grandparents land and then this area is for my auntie and then this one and then that one also and then over here my auntie and then my my mom's land is at the edge of this land also and we are going to build a small house like this one here look at this yes we're going to build a small house also there because we have a lot of vegetables yeah at least this is our land it's not like for rent or for lease okay so let's go we go ready daddy earlier dad is making a way for this truck to pass there because that's our area oh. careful We made it there finally so by the way our area is here it's elevated very good ready study Tawa pun mai. I am removing the stone for a better and safe path. The area was rocky but we have a good soil, good location and good view. Right now, I am removing the branches because we will use this wood for column. Most of the wood we use for the farmhouse are used or from the farm. I need to spend less for this farmhouse project. We are here right now at the cocoa farm. Look at me. Look at me. Yeah. So we are going to build the house here. Lots of stuff we did for the past few hours. I didn't hire any workers right now because <laughs> I can't afford to pay only me Marifel and dad doing this as you can see in my background we already have two um, column that is cutting some trees over there to put because we need four and this cottage looks like cottage house size eight feet by nine feet I'm so tired already. <laughs> yeah, I'm so tired already. And by the way, guys, the corn that we plant here already growing. Like, as you can see, I'll show you. This one? Yes, that's one of the corn that we plant five days ago. And then this one right here as well. And then these as well. It's all over here. And this side is sweet corn. This side is white corn huh? this is the jimilina that we cut today my dad cut it earlier now he's cutting it into half so that we have another one because we are lucky of two column this one and then the other one go 
Ô mamãe. Guta tai bugat. Bunte na mga bato ninyo matumban ha. Ô mamãe, a tunga. Gi. Kaya? Tanggaan ajun. Dayong tabe. Dayong na lang na. So, these are the nails that we are going to use. All of these are used from the fish pond house. Yes. I'm going to like straight this one. We use flat stone as column footers to avoid them from getting wet when it's rain. I am so thankful with my family for helping and supporting me in everything I do, especially to my dad. My mom was also happy because this was her birthplace. My dad is not that expert in building, but we made it. We started preparing the footers and then the column and then the assistants are the girls. It's so funny because the girls are not expert in this field, but we can help. The job was taking so long, but we already have progress. I'm so excited to see the result. <laughs> So we got some snack. We have bread and juice. Bon appetit! Hard working people! Working at the farm makes us hungry because we are tired. So every time we have a job here, I buy snacks for all of us. Building a house was actually fun, especially when you help building the house. It makes you happy seeing the progress with your hard work. We are going to clean at the back of this house to garden and plant vegetables. This is the neighbor's land, but for sure they will be happy if we clean and garden the land. Um, this is the job for today. This is only a few hours, not like the whole day. And then again tomorrow. Okay, so welcome to our day two. So right now, this is our day two of building the um, farmhouse. It's a very small farmhouse, size of eight feet by nine feet. And right now, here, they are disregard. It's the English of like taking out the wood at the truck. Marifel, terunggu pun nak ui. Marifel is the little laborer. Okay, guys. So welcome to our day two of our farmhouse project. And right now is the one week of our sweet corn, white corn, and yellow corn. As you can see in my background, I think it's you can see it pretty clearly, right? So that's the one week grow of the sweet corn and then in this side is white corn it's broken so right now i am going to plant the area that the seeds didn't grow so i have here a little sweet corn then i'm going to plant two or three pieces depends on the distance yes but usually it's like two feet apart from each other and then three seeds um, two feet apart and then three seeds so if that's less than two feet and then I'm going to put two seeds okay let's go I'm going to change because you know it's broken so right now I am wearing some gloves because last week I have like uh, blisters because of like digging Oh my god, it's so hot. It's not yet done, but I plant also some long beans. Then we still have more. 
it's super hot right now here I feel so dizzy then we're going to plant this uh, lemongrass as well actually we have a lot of plants to plant because of the sweet corn most of the area is already occupied then after two weeks we are going to put some fertilizer and this area takes a lot of fertilizer I'm so tired you know the weather in Philippines right now is very hot planting at this hot weather is super hot I'm also not feeling well because I have very bad runny nose this is already a week or two weeks I take medicine but it's not working maybe it's because I'm always out in this kind of weather but if I stay home like it takes a lot of electricity because I turn on the air conditioning because once you're home it's very hot in there before the summer ends if we can stay in this small house because the hot weather here is better than our home because lots of trees I know too it's a bit windy while at home it's no wind I mean there's wind of course you know it's just like not so windy I'm sweating oh I'm such a farmer of course the things that you see in my videos are not even half of the hard work I did of course you're not going to vlog eight hours a day right and then we're working every day win please win I need some air and then right there my dad is removing the nails at the used wood from the fish pond then we're going to put it here Hopefully we can finish the roof today. I'll probably resume planting later to this afternoon, early evening, because it's very hot. Oh wait, we're going home. By the way, we did one night here. Marifa, my cousin, and Rian did tent, and then we are sleeping at my auntie's small house, farmhouse as well. I'm gonna show you. A childhood memories I have here in this area. I am putting some towel on my back because it's very hot and my my back is already wet. My clothes is already wet. So anyway, I am going to show you this one. And the last time I was here before when I was seven years old. Now they're swimming. This area is the only cement they have this side as you can see and then this one this cement is new so this is the water and by the way guys this water is connected to the area that we go for fishing by the way and right here it's a bit deeper in here and I see some fish actually before this is this area is also where we go for washing clothes, chatera. Wow, I'm glad this area is still functional. I thought it's empty water already. I remember I had a fight when I was a kid in here. Wow. Before this cement is only cement they have and then right now this is the new one I guess because there's a lot of broken cement like this one because and then also in this side like in this side you can walk here and this is where we wash our clothes from that water and then right now it's very um, small and by the way guys this area i'm sure there's a snake because it's not hot oh i see some fish lapisan wow there's a big pait pait also uh-uh okay now i know where we go for fishing oh there's a lot of bee i, I don't know if you can see it but there's a lot of flying bee okay this area is still going there yeah, I'm not going there right now. 
It's very refreshing to see that your childhood memories comes back because you've seen so many things from the past. There's a lot of lansones. Okay, so I can pass here, I guess. Mm. So this is the purpose of this cement. By the way guys, this water from here is more than 3 kilometers. It's because from Matanag Pool to here is 2.5 already. And then this way, there's more in this area. And down here, I guess it's still more 1 kilometer. I am not sure, but it's not walkable because there's a lot of grass on the side, as you can see on the side, this side, there's grass on this side. It's supposed to be you can walk before you can actually walk in this area, right here. Because um, the people before use this water for washing clothes, etc. But right now, that everyone has water source in their houses, they don't use this water anymore. But I'm glad it is still like functional. I thought it's already like empty water. Okay, so I guess we're going now because it's raining. I need to go. <laughs> it's raining right now. So by the way guys, from here to the cocoa farm is about five minutes walk. Ay, it's raining! <laughs> okay, so earlier Raddy Teddy was stuck in there and then all of the girls pushing Raddy Teddy backwards and then dad is trying to pass this area because it's very small because there's a big rocks in there and then there's a um, coconut in here. Gay! Pangunit mo! Ay, na shot. Idoot lang namo ni Tay. Ha? Idoot namo. Okay. Let's push it. Ay, na Another one? Ato sa mauli itani magsigil ni ingon ani. Ayo ka atras ha. Kamira na pong jacket kayo. Hello, Okay, so right now <laughs> I'm trying to sue sue the pampers of Sophia because she play with it and look she does this like many of it so instead of throwing it I just do this because it's a waste of money if I just throw all of the broken pampers Okay, so it's done in this part and this part and uh, yes. Still useful. It's an open package. So it's a bubble. 
Mm, smells so good. This is our dishwashing liquid budget for a year. We're going to dissolve this dishwashing liquid to 14 liters of water. Oh, this is it. <laughs> so we need to sip this for 24 hours. Or at least overnight. If you guys enjoy, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to click the notification bell to keep you updated. And thank you so much for the continued support. Bye everyone! <laughs>